Hello my friends, Liberty Garden coming to you from the ranch, September 19th. And today before I get to working on the fence, I decided to shoot another little shooting video. This time I'm using a Marlin 60 right there. And it's a 22 rifle, semi-automatic. I think it takes 14 in the tube, tube fed. And um, it's brand new. I just, I just, I just uh, took it out of my safe yesterday. I bought it about four or five years ago. I had never fired it, so I decided to bring it out here and just kind of plink a little bit with it. So the first, uh, these are six-inch holes. These six-inch plates, those circles, and uh, the first I was shooting from about 50 yards, the center one. So I was hit or miss on those things, really. I could barely, you could barely see the uh, the sights and 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 the and the plate. I mean, I could see it, but it was kind of far. Then this one here is from about 30 yards, and then this one is from about 40 yards. And I noticed that uh, on these two, at least, I mean. I, uh, if you look at these these sights here, uh, they're very small sights. So I was really having trouble focusing my eyes on on the on the itty bitty sights. And you got eyes over 40, you know what I'm talking about. And uh, so I put on my reading glasses, which is not optimal for shooting a rifle either. But just at least I was able to 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 get a clearer uh, a clearer picture a clearer picture of the back sight and um, at least put put it more better like that so when i did this one i did this with, on a rest standing on a rest this this was freehand and this one was ho holding onto a tree and this one i was resting on a, on a corral panel about 40 yards 40 yards back so this one i was aiming up here the first time i was shooting on a rest aiming right for the center and all the shots were coming down here so then I began, began aiming around this area here at the very top and the shots started grouping down here at 40 yards. So I need to make some adjustments to, to the iron sights, but more than anything, I think I need to get some reading glasses. <laughs> I mean, some uh, a, a little scope on this thing. Uh, I'm not at a point where I need uh, distance glasses, but I do use reading glasses or computer glasses. Uh, but uh, looking at that, little, at that little iron sight in the back there is just uh, painful. I also shot this little can. This shot, this little can has been shot multiple times by 38s and 357s, and I shot it a bunch of times with the little 22s. You can see the little holes right there. Uh, that was just kind of when I started just kind of plinking, see what I see what I was getting. Ironically, it never fell off. It, it just stood there. You know, the, the bullets were just whizzing right through it, and it never fell down <laughs> because I had it, I had it against that little piece of block of wood right there. And the and the and the canner fell down. The bulls just were, were just going right through it. But anyway, um, thanks for watching, folks. And until next time, bye bye.